So my name is Hafiz Imtiaz and, and I am a graduate research assistant in, in the EC department of Rutgers University and I have been working with Professor Sarwate for the last uh, one year. So what we are, we are working on is, is differential privacy. So it's not directly related with, with, with any diseases or anything, but it's like, uh, it's like ensuring security while ensuring uh, the utility of the algorithm. I am from Bangladesh, and and I was I was uh, I was a faculty member at Bangladesh University of Engineering and T Technology. Then I came to the United States in in this Rutgers University as a PhD student in fall 2014. Yeah, my parents are are both are medical doctors, so they uh, so they are actively into research. So they also encourage me. Growing up, I saw them uh, doing research and, and and helping each other with their research. So I think that uh, that also, I mean, on some level, that also encouraged me to uh, come into the research field. I have I have been working on signal processing and and image processing for my for my undergrad thesis and then master thesis. So, uh, so the things that I am doing here, I, I can say that they are not exactly, uh, exactly directly related with the things that I have been doing in my undergrad or MS, but, but they, are, uh, they are actually a continuation of, of those uh, research. I was looking forward to a Career in in the academia, so so I've been planning to be a faculty member in, at my university. I like that I can. I mean, I I think I can uh, improve something with my critical thinking. We are four people in this lab, and Professor Sarwat is our supervisor. So uh, three of us are now working in this differential privacy regime. So uh, sometimes we collaborate and share our ideas between us to uh, to find a new direction or something. One of the most challenging things to me uh, after coming here was the mathematical sophistication that I was not used to, but, but I think I am catching up and uh, I think I, I, am, uh, I am trying to overcome the obstacles. It's a very technical and of I, I would say sophisticated area area of some big area so if we can achieve what we are trying to do it might help help, help doing some other stuff more uh, more easily or precisely but I would say that research is I mean if you feel research is very interesting and yeah, you always get to discover new things you always get to learn new things you 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 learn to you learn to look at uh, things like algorithms or stuff from different angles and and uh, and once you learn one uh, algorithm then you can apply it to some some other area that has not been thought of before